All right, welcome back to uh, the Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Plus with your boy Hot Dinner. Uh, last run we did, we had an Azazel run, and we just completely steamrolled the entire game. Did boss rush, beat mom's heart. Um, this game, I'm gonna test. I'm gonna play with Eden. I've got four Eden tokens. May as well start using them. Um, his special thing is he. All of his stats are completely random. And I think you spawn with two random items. I think either a space bar and a passive, or both passive, one of the two. But here we go. I'm gonna play as Eden. He's kind of a crapshoot sometimes. Okay, so we got skinny odd mushrooms. So we got a pretty good fire rate. Our damage is garbage at 2.26. Then we've got friendly ball. Um, and a spirit heart and, okay. Can I catch him? No, nope, apparently not. Never really used friendly ball too much. Please die. Okay. Um, with this, we are looking for some damage. Like 100%, that's the number one thing I want is damage. Just because my fire rate's good. Just gotta get those dams. There we go. Okay, two of spades. We're gonna hang on to that in case, unless we need bombs or I don't remember if it's bombs or keys. Let me drop it and see what see what it says. It says item multiplier. Dang. Either bombs or keys. I don't remember. Okay, what do we got in our item room? The halo. Let's go. There's some little bit of damage. Fire rate didn't go down any. Um. Whoa. Just a little unfortunate, but we'll hopefully, I mean, it's not really a big deal, honestly, this early in the game. Um, I don't think we're capped. I think the cap is like, I want to say the cap is like five or three or something like that. Let's see if we can kind of group them and just really lay into all of them. If I can get up to like five damage, I think. That, oh, five damage, I'd be okay with that. Come on, blow up, blow up, blow up on everybody. There we go. Nope, don't want that. I need to start meal prepping again. Oh my gosh, the fires! I need to start doing meal prep again because I would have the physique of like a Greek god if I just did not eat garbage all the time. Like, um. Like, normally, like, my my lunches and dinners are pretty okay, but um, there are days where, like, my, my issue is, like, I, I, I gotta find something to snack on in the middle of the day, because, like, for instance, today, I, I got done with my workout. Um, today was back day. Super good time. Um, love doing bend over rows. Um, didn't deadlift today, because I'm gonna do squat tomorrow, I think. Don't want my hamstrings to be all tired. Oh my gosh, Dangle, why do you have so much health? I don't think I get friendly ball bosses. Nope. But, um, I didn't do deadlift, but I did do, like, basically just about everything else you can imagine for back. I also do biceps on my back day. Because, you know, back and by. Because uh, I do, like, push and pull and legs, basically. Um, we're going to take that. Uh, I don't really want Cursed Skull. I'm going to drop Cursed Skull. Picked it up just because um, in the game to... Sometimes to get unlocks, I think you got to pick up <laughs> every, like, trinket or something. To get like the oh that's way better than friendly ball glad i came in here totally worth it although the flies aren't going to do a ton of damage because it's double of what my original damage is but any damage is good damage except negative damage Which essentially it's like healing i guess i don't know but like i said tomorrow i'm gonna do legs um probably gonna do squat and uh, leg press, but 
Oh. Lost it. Okay. Self. You need to focus up. Stop talking about your workouts. The pencil. Lead pencil. So lead pencil, um, I think it's like every seven shots. No. I think it's just every... I don't know if it's random or not. Um, every so many shots I shoot like a bunch of... Like, almost like a Monstro's Long kind of shot. I don't know if I've shown that item yet. But it's just kind of like a vomiting of shots. And with having this high of a fire rate, it's gonna go off pretty pretty frequently. So we're gonna try to remember to use Guppy's head every single opportunity we have. Um, but yeah, I'm planning tomorrow to have um, some more of that uh, Alfredo tortellini. I think it's tortellini. It's like a cheesy ravioli kind of thing, but it's I think it's tortellini um, noodles. It's got like chicken and cheese, I think, in it. And then I'm going to do it with Alfredo and Parmesan cheese. Probably be good to do some hot sauce with it too, but... I don't know if we have any hot sauce. Could buy some, but... I don't know. Kind of... I, I, I don't know if... I don't know if I'm frugal with my money. I'm not, like, cheap or anything, but... Um... Oh, so... Why do you... Why do you do the things you do? But... I'm, I'm just very... Conscious, I guess, of my spending. I mean, I'm in no way like need to watch my spending um i'm not like trying to flex or anything but um come on pick up pick up the heart why why are you doing why are you doing that why can't okay uh we'll pop up his head and we'll go to the next floor like i'm i'm not in like danger or anything but i just i i kind of like weigh my options like i could you know i could buy this or i could you know, save it instead, or, or I could invest it, and, you know, I feel like a lot of people nowadays, especially my, gosh, dang it, I need to find some spirit hearts, because, like, I cannot trust myself to take no damage on these floors, but, um, like, for instance, I bought, so, like, these new, the new, um, Sony earbuds that, they're, like, they're, like, noise canceling and all that good stuff, but, like, they were, I think, 200 and wishbone. Make a wish. No idea what that does. Um, they were like $234 because, like, my headphones kind of crapped out. And I um, needed a new pair. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to treat myself. And first off, like, <sighs> first off, I need to stop taking damage. That would be awesome as I take damage. Um,. B7. What's that doing? Bureau rewards. Can't yeah, pass. I'm gonna use my two. Yeah, okay, that, that was for keys. So spades is keys. Clubs is bombs. But, um, the headphones, like, they were. I mean, they were good quality, don't get me wrong, but my ears aren't, like, like fine tuned to any stretch of the imagination. Um,. So a lot of like the, you know, a lot of the quality I think is kind of lost just because my ears are trash. Um, which I'd probably have to blame like Q-tips and stuff for because I probably shove them like way too far into my ears. Which I think a lot of people do that. Um, okay. Before I leave this floor, I'm going to hopefully buy a spirit heart. That'll give me some insurance for the next floor and hopefully solidify like a deal with the devil or something because I have a lot of red health that I can trade away and I already have one third of guppy but the headphones they were they were all right the noise canceling was kind of meh honestly um and you know in my mind if I'm gonna spend 230 dollars on headphones I mean they better be freaking flawless you know so I don't know if I just had too high of expectations but I ended up like sending them back because, like, it interfered with, like, my smartwatch, like, Bluetooth connection did, and all, like, it just, it was cutting out. Um, it was nice because it, like, immediately connected. The second I, like, took them out of the case, it was, like, boom, connected to your phone. 
Um, but did I get a double chance? Double deal? Oh, more red health though. Uh, so, and you know, it had like a, I think it was like a five hour battery life and then five hours from the case and stuff. But uh, one of my big issues is I couldn't use, uh, I couldn't use only one of them. Well, I could, but it was, I could only use the left one uh, to listen to music. Well, I could have the right one in the case, but I couldn't do the other way. I couldn't like just have the right one in and the left one in the case. I don't know if like the left one was like the master headphone or whatever to that controls like the Bluetooth or, or whatnot. But um, that really sucks because normally my uh, I listen to music in my right ear, um, especially when I work. Like that well, really that's the only time I listen to music in my right ear is when I'm at work doing online grocery and you know, work takes up like freaking 10 hours of my life every day almost. Um, and you know, when you're, when you like, and the reasoning I put it in my right ear is because I think my left ear hears better than my right. And I, I looked it up. What is this? Scorpio poison tears. That's good. Um, tear effects are also a good thing because it gives, it's like a damage upgrade kind of. Um, but I think I looked it up and normally like everyone's got like a dominant ear I think either a dominant ear or like one ear is better than the other I mean that may just be essentially a dominant ear, but uh, My left one here is better and or is the dominant ear um, and I want to get out of here, please Can I not be okay? Uh, so it kind of sucked um, listening to music in my dominant ear because you know if people ask questions and stuff like it was kind of hard for me to hear uh it did the the headphones did have like an ambient sound control like i can control how much noise canceling there was and how much like you know outside noise came in um but it wasn't like good enough to where i could like perfectly hear people and normally if i just have my right earphone in I can hear people so that was kind of another like strike I guess oh there goes the spirit heart all right no more, no more damage no more damage gotta get that deal with the devil need more damage oh that's not fun I don't like this got his, got his paw, uh, fly fly killer yeah what's down there I feel like a thing is down here there's oh there's keys and stuff cool yeah I don't know if that's worth it. Got another guppy's head charge though. All right, boss fight, let's go. Oh my gosh. But, um, the headphones. So I ended up like sending them back cause uh, honestly it wasn't, in my opinion, worth $230. So I ended up getting that back. I bought like, ah, uh, oh, why didn't I just stay in the corner? I ended up getting like a $40-ish pair of headphones. They were, I think, originally like 60, but they were all like rollback at Walmart or something. Luck down. Awesome. Down. That's just what I wanted. Um, I have anything to buy with a key? Oh, we'll just go down. So I, I like sent them back and got refunded um, and then used that money to buy uh, another pair of headphones. And these, these guys are... I mean, they're good. I like them. Um, they're more like for sport stuff. So like, you know, I wear them when I work out and stuff. Um, and they've got like a 10 hour battery life and the volume controls and pause controls are a lot. I think this signifies like there's a secret room here sometimes. Nope. Oh well, Spirit Heart is good enough too. But uh, I ended up using that money for uh, like I said, the other headphones, and then my brother and I, we went in on buying a TV, and we ended up getting like a 58 inch, it was a, like a crazy deal, it was like a 58 inch TV, um, like the brand was the Hisense brand, oh, self, why did I, oh, is that what Wishbone does, take enough damage, I get a free item, that's nice, uh, but we got a 58 inch TV, and we each went on on it. Infamy damage reduction, good. And it was so it was like 140 bucks for me. Um, 
to get a 58 inch TV and we, sh we have it down in our basement. And I hope to one day purchase a capture card and play some games on my Switch. By the way, Infamy, what it does is it, uh, it's got a chance to like negate a, a bullet, I guess, like, or a shot. So that's also just gonna help me get like deals with the devil and stuff. Kamikaze pass. Uh, but yeah, they like some. I don't know. Sometimes I I get like a little uh, too ambitious with stuff, and I'll just like go out on a whim and buy something. And, and like normally, I like to do my research. Full health. Um, but and I did. I mean, you know, a lot of people were like liking the reviews and stuff, or they liked the product overall. And um, don't get me wrong, like. Like I said, the sound quality was good, but just for what I needed them for, didn't didn't fit the bill. And at that price point, you know, if it doesn't fit the bill really, really well, I think I wedge myself in there. There we go. Um, if it doesn't fit the bill really well for two hundred and thirty dollars, then I'm gonna send it back and get something else. I've I've found that I'm pretty I'm a pretty like. Um, pretty heavily into value with stuff. Um, I, I find that with, uh, like food and stuff too, off, pretty often. Um, I, you know, food, to me, like, I don't, and maybe, maybe it's just because I don't have, like, you know, master chef taste buds or whatever. But, like, it, it's, it's, some food, like, it's good, but you're just kind of like, eh. Like, don't get me wrong, I can I can tell the difference. Like, you know, there's a big quality difference in like, you know, Little Caesars pizza versus like Papa John's or like Pizza Hut, you know, there's, those are two completely different levels. But like, if I'm going to, you know, if I'm going to like a, like a steakhouse or something, I'll just, you know, the chicken there is like, I, I by the way, like if one of those things that's weird about me is uh, I'm not, don't really care much for steak. Um, did not even see those spikes down there. Um, I don't really care much for steak. It just, to me, it doesn't have a ton of flavor. And then everybody that I tell that to, they're like, oh, well, you haven't had a good steak. And it's like, yeah, yeah, I have. I've, I've been there. I've had filet. Um, I've, or filet mignon. It was, it was, it was all right, but it wasn't like $30 all right. <laughs> um, but like normally I'll go, I'll get like chicken um, or like pork. You know, but normally I like lean cuts of beef and stuff. I'm just kind of, eh, not really my, my thing. All right, Monstro 2. We can take one hit of damage, and that's all we're allowed. Shoot for the moon here. Oh, Infamy, you've done it again. You beautiful, beautiful item. Nope, please leave me alone, friend. Thank you. I need to stand in front of him so he shoots his flipping laser. No, don't stand in front of him there. Poison bomb. Boom. Poison bomb again. Boom. Get some poison damage in on him. Get behind him. Blarg on him a couple times. That was a good shot. That was a good amount of hit. Come on, don't screw this up, self. There we go, got him. Sit down, son, 100% chance. What we got. All right. Um, sure. Uh, we got a tinted rock over here. Got a chest. Oh boy, totally worth it. All right, next floor. But normally I like to go for quantity um, over quality. Like, if I'm going to like McDonald's, I'll get, um, I, I like to stick in the McChicken McDouble realm. Because, I don't know, it's just, 
it appeals more to me than like a quarter pound of cheese or a double quarter pound of cheese. Like to me, like a double quarter pound of cheese, it's not worth like the four fifty five dollars you pay for it. You just get like two McDoubles, you know, it's like three bucks. Or get like, like, cause normally what like my go to is, or uh, at least it used to be till they changed it. Um, I I had like the McDonald's app, and I would get the. Uh, they used to have a deal on there. It was like a large fry for a dollar. Like you scan a QR code and it gave you like a large fry for only a dollar. And then they like, now, then they changed it for a little bit and it was like a dollar off a large fry. And now it's like, oh, these are not fun. I don't know if I'm fast enough for this. Yeah. I'm gonna save that metal one. And, <laughs> oh, you, you done ran into it. But now I think it's like buy any fry and get one for a dollar or something. It's they, they keep changing it. I think they were probably losing too much money because like I was doing that. It was only me that made this a problem. But I'll look at their um, their deals on their app a lot of the time, um, pretty much every single time before I go. Just because I think it's kind of, I mean, it's silly to, you know, go there and overpay oh well, technically like overpay when you could just all you have to do is scan a code off of your phone oh well, whatever that is use diaper like it takes two seconds oh you did me dirty Can i have a penny thanks um i would love to get bff you could give me a dime? No. Oh. Man, if I could get BFF. Um, BFF, I think, that would double the damage of my flies. So that would that would essentially be a damage up. But I'm not lucky enough to have that much stuff. Okay. Good. Gummy's head. But, yeah, it's... I've always kind of been like that. And... I think it kind of is more so like, you know, well, like as a kid, you know, when you spend like, when you're technically spending your parents' money, like you really don't care a whole lot about value. And then, you know, you get your first job and you realize that, hey, that money's not as, you know, it doesn't go as far as you think it would. Like, it's always like, I remember when I was growing up, like I got my first job, I worked at McDonald's, um, like most most kids working in fast food. And like, you know, you start out, I was making like 7.25 an hour and I was like, boom, I've got so much money now. And then like the second you get a job, you start getting like responsibilities and like bills that you have to pay for. Like I was, I would work and then I, um, then I started having to pay like cell phone bill and all this other stuff. And like my, my paychecks just kind of started dwindling away. And I don't know, it just, it, it feels like uh, once you start getting paid and, and then even if you get like paid more too, sometimes, like it still feels like the bills increase or you like you, you know, I mean, I'm sure that might just be a lifestyle adaptation. Like you're like, oh, I have more money now. I can spend more money and you do. Um, but yeah, it's, it just seems that way. And, you know, people always think, like, oh, if I had more money, I'd be happy. Or happier. What is going on? Is this the diaper? Just leaving stink clouds everywhere? Oh, you just... Game, you give me pageant boy with a bunch of money, and I want to go back, but I can't. What is it? Is the diaper just... I just, like, leave little fart clouds everywhere or something? Could you imagine getting pants right in front of a girl you're trying to give a flower to? I'd be pretty upset. Okay, still, still looking for some damage. Um, but I mean, you know, overall we don't have a horrible build going on. Um, I have found a new game to play, by the way, too. I'm gonna record that after this episode. Can you cut yeah, there you go.
That was a pretty good shot. Okay, no tinted rocks there. Oh, there's a tinted rock right here. Gotta have eagle eyes, even though I probably missed like a million of them on the... Good lord, I'm getting nothing from these chests. I would love to get Cricket's head. Oh no. And this guy. Or is this the bean? I don't know what's doing that little fart cloud. It might be the bean. Probably the bean. I don't know what the diaper does. Other than apparently smell bad. There's a tinted rock in there. Come here, sweet, sweet tinted rock. Another chest. Come on. Okay. That's... That's okay. Oh no. Oh no. Leave me alone. Open to just steamroll straight to the boss room, really. I mean, there's not a whole lot I can get off of the floor. I'm not a fan of these things. I don't like their shooting pattern. I don't like anything that shoots out in like a hexagonal pattern. Because it's harder to read versus like the up, down, left, right kind of. Hey, another tinted rock. Wow, there are a lot of them on this floor. Okay, we cannot mess this up. Like, we've got two spirit hearts, and we're gonna fight a boss, Loki. He's getting crazy. There's tinted rock in here. Probably shouldn't be looking for that, but. I'm gonna focus on one half of him. Try to really tear into him. Ow! I may have, uh, okay, never mind. I thought for a second, like I switched halfway through into the, onto the wrong one. Again with that hexagonal pattern. Oh, come on, okay, okay, we can do it. 67% chance, very doable. There we go. Got it, growth hormone, damage up. What we got? Oh, let's go. This is what we needed. Welcome everybody to the Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. It's like the, um, in my opinion, one of like the best items known as Brimstone. It's it, it, essentially, it's a Zazel shot, but it goes on forever. And I almost walked over the spikes, but that's okay. Cause we got Brimstone, next floor. Okay, what do we got? We got a double key room here, bunch of stuff. A joker card? No. Be nice. Skeleton key. Use two of diamonds. There's nothing I really need. Still don't have great damage, but Brimstone still does a lot of damage. It's really good for handling like crowds. Like, you know, flies or stuff like this. This guy can just Go fall in a hole or trip and fall. Okay, um, there we go. Oh, thought there was more to that route. More of the. I thought I could go up a little higher. Bye, friend. I don't. I'm not a fan of all the spikes that are all over the floor, man. All right. Um, yeah, Leo, let's do it. Let's send it. Welcome to Bullet Hell, AKA Mom. Mom's heart, I guess. Oh no. Hey, I got a heart out of that. Um, oh dang. I can do this. Be all right. There we go. Okay, well. I didn't get a deal with the devil because I got hit. Um, I'm hoping to go to Shoal one time, but all right, let's see what ending we get. Back is all stiff. From my spine between my shoulder blades. My rhombus. Oh.
What the heck was that? Everything is terrible. Game just got harder. Oh, that's good. Okay, well, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, like, comment, subscribe, uh, share the video. And as always, I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful day. I hope life's going great for you. Bye-bye.